we're headed to Door County. <laughs> you do it. <laughs> headed to Door County. You're still, what for, honey? We are headed to Door County for, oh. Oh dear, an ambulance. Okay, well, we're going to pause. Stop. We're stopping this. Okay, we're back. Um, hopefully everybody's okay after the ambulance fiasco. As you can see, Megan is driving. We're headed to Door County for uh, anniversary celebration. Um, yeah, this should be fun. First stop in Green Bay is the Green Bay Botanical Gardens that we've never been to before. Yep, that's a gift that Megan got me for our anniversary. So, one of them. So, we'll see how that is. We can see what the cars next to us are thinking of us talking to ourselves. <laughs> Quick stop at Quick Trip for breakfast. We have little yogurt cups that we got, um, and then we have like a bunch of miscellaneous food. So we have bagel thins, um, we have a bag of ham, um, we have a couple little cheeses, and then across the street. Thank oh. you, Quick Trip gave us utensils and condiments. <laughs> right, so that's good. And then across the street, like hidden directly behind this tree. <laughs> you know the one. <laughs> There's a Starbucks, so we're gonna get a cold brew after we're done as a treat before we head back on the road. Oh, and we're in Wausau, in case that's interesting for anybody. Got a mask on, probably. Probably. We just made it to the Green Bay Botanical Gardens, and we're gonna get our tickets checked in and walk around. We've never been here before, but uh, Got our masks. Should be set to go. Here we go. You guys, someone's getting married. Congratulations. <laughs> Got ourselves a map. Got myself a beautiful wife. <laughs> and the first thing Jody said when we walked out the door was, oh, fountain. <laughs> so she already likes it. We'll be able to do this scavenger hunt. No problem. Oh, what is these tall ones? Jurassic Park plants. Play pot. Is that on our list? Nope. Oh. <laughs> Good job, sweetheart. You think so? I don't think so. Then I found a spider. You see it down here? I do. Oh, lady, leave me be. <laughs> Sorry, guy. Lady, please. I'll bite you. <laughs> We've only made it in the garden like 15 feet, and we already have three things crossed off. barely like just barely smell something. Smells terrible. <laughs> These weird little fuzz things. Hey, this is what was in that I think a bumblebee this time. A butterfly? Oh, that's a Jody found grapes. You like walk through it's so cool. This place is beautiful so far so Definitely recommend a stop here. That's where we were up there. For the record, when we're outside and away from people, we don't need to wear our masks, but we're still carrying them. It's true, because any building we go They said just the buildings, so we're not wearing them because we don't have to right now because we're not by anybody. But if we were, we would be wearing them. So everybody should wear their masks when they're by people. Quick recap of what happened. <laughs> you see how yeah, there's like these ridges? I stepped and like fell like so kinda. I reached out for Jody. She didn't know I was reaching for her, so I almost like fell. And she said, sorry, I didn't know you were reaching for me. It's not like you fell down. It's not like you fell down the hill and this started happening. <laughs> Would that be funny? <laughs> no, I mean, it didn't happen. The thought of you tumbling down the hill. I'm a terrible wife. I know. <laughs> wow. That's cool. The wedding is happening. They're getting married. 
we don't even know these people, let's be real, but we are a sucker for a good wedding, so we're watching. It's happening. She's walking down the aisle. She's walking down the long set of stairs. Okay, update. There's gonna be another wedding in a different part of the garden. This is my favorite day ever. That's where the second wedding is gonna be, and there's a guy here setting up the audio. And he said, I said, this is gonna be so pretty. And he said, you can come for the wedding. So pretty sure that counts as an invite. It totally does. Whoa, seven feet. Is true? No, no, but you're- Six? Almost. We just found the cutest little area. Look at this little dragonfly bench. And then there's a little waterfall and a dragonfly bridge. Jody sees dragonflies around and for us that means her granny came to visit so this is such a sweet little spot to find this is the coolest weirdest little area back here the children's garden honey oh that makes sense another one flying by the kite totally <laughs> maybe i can get them to land that'd be awesome wouldn't it oh uh, yeah <laughs> uh, ma'am, please don't step on the plants. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> gumdrop. Candyland pieces. Oh, this is gumdrop. Look at all the butterflies. Oh my gosh. <laughs> gumdrop candy zinnia. Hi, friend. You are beautiful. You are beautiful. I'm trying to catch the butterflies. Pardon me. Are you Aaron Burr, sir? Depends on who's asking. Oh, well, sure, sir. <laughs> Whoever you are and wherever you live, drive to Green Bay and come here. We have never stopped here before. We just always tool right through on our way up to Door County or we came here for a Packer game, but otherwise we've never just come to see what's here. And honestly, this garden has been the coolest experience. I'm so, so happy that we came. Okay, so we made it to Square Rigger. That's where we stay. We um, normally rent a cottage here right on Lake Michigan every June for a week. Here we're just staying in a little two bedroom one a little ways back from the lake because that one's a three bedroom and it's just the two of us. So we literally only need one bedroom. Um, so Joe's checking us in, but we're finally up in Door County. We had a lot of pit stops along the way and it was a two Starbucks kind of day. But uh, you can see a little bit of the lake, just a teeny little bit from right here. I'll show you. It's a teensy weensy little sliver out there. Lake Michigan seriously is our fave. I mean, Lake Superior is beautiful too, but Lake Michigan definitely has our heart. So Square Rigger is kind of cool. Um, it's in Jacksonport on the lake side, so you don't get all the crazy traffic you do on the bay side, but it's still only like a 10 minute drive from all the cute towns over there. So they have all these like hotel rooms and suites and then they have a bunch of cottages that you can rent and stay at right on the water to orient you here's number two that we're staying in it's the one closest to the road a little two bedroom and there is lake michigan so the rest of these this is a duplex right there in front of us and then that's um a three bedroom and then the one we stay in for the week is right back over there right on the sand so really really close Okay, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like here quick. Um, the last time we stayed in this one was in October 2016. Um, we stayed here for two nights and that's what how we found this place and how we started staying here every summer for a week. So we haven't been in this cottage since then when it was just the two of us. So it's a lot smaller um, than the one we're used to staying in and it's not right on the lake but it's still super cute. So I'll show you what it looks like. So we come in <laughs> to this pineapple hanging. The left in from the door is a bathroom. I have seriously no memory of this bathroom whatsoever. Jody remembers it, but I don't remember this at all. Um, so here's the little bathroom. 
here's one of the two bedrooms. It's got like a full size bed. Then here's the door again. You can see the lake is out there. Here is the bedroom we stay in. So this is the second one we stay in. Like we've stayed here so often. This is literally the second time in this cabin. But here's ours. Cute. And here's the living room, dining room, kitchen, slash everything room. So there's a little deck. We have some seating. Beer, essential. We have our little table, a little TV. Everything you need there. And then we have a little porch um, out here with a grill. And again, the water is just down there. This is the most calm I think I've ever seen Lake Michigan in my life. Our two favorite chairs, these red and blue. And this cottage right here, right in front of us, is the one we normally stay in for a week. So that's really awesome because then we can walk right out onto the beach. But for now, for a long weekend, we're happy where we're at. Hi. Here we are, <laughs> relaxing. It's so calm, you guys. So calm. There, I mean, there's like a gaggle of geese out on the water. I've never the seen table. that before. You see that? <laughs> Cheers. My love. My life. Not as bad as you would think. My beautiful wife. Trying to convince me that it is not cold. Just want the world to see how sweet my Jody is. She's gonna hate that I'm filming this. Yes. <laughs> I was in the lake and I had sand on my feet, and she's literally kneeling in the sand to wipe the dried sand off my feet. Thank you, my sweetheart. Should I tell now how you made me do that? Did I make you? No. <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> ask you to. <laughs> I know. Thank you. You liked it. It was very sweet. sitting here at our table outside just ordered our appetizer and our drinks and we got a faulty mask situation happening here <laughs> so we're macgyvering it with a key to see if we can poke a hole in to I mean we're literally like a block from where we're staying so she could like hold it but you know <laughs> oops <laughs> update it's been 15 minutes whatever <laughs> kidding <laughs> but we did get our drinks i got a door county cherry mo mojito that's in like this nice little to-go cup got some chips and then we have the most amazing looking queso oh my god okay shrimp tacos for me with chili lime sauce and a big old basket of lake perch for jode <laughs> Yeah. And we clearly didn't like that at all. Look at the sky. That's the water. That orange thing there is the water. Holy moly. Look at this. <laughs> this is real life right now. True, unfiltered, oh my gosh. Look, look how beautiful. I have no words, so. Okay, I know this doesn't look like much. We saw this and we were like, what is that? Is that the sun? The freaking moon is rising. Moonrise.
Oh, I wish that you could see this on camera. Oh my God. Butter. So we've been sitting here for, I don't even know how long, maybe 40 minutes. I know I keep going out of focus, sorry, but the moon has risen considerably. Like to the point where we, you still can't see on the camera, but to the point where like we can see each other, like plain as day. It is bright out. Obviously you can see it reflecting in the water. This has been so, so cool. Okay, we were obviously awestruck by this and we did not say goodnight or close anything out. So um, I'm just gonna put a picture at the end here of the amazing Moonrise picture versus the video because you can see it a lot better. It was beautiful. The best way to end the night by far.